I was gonna get this far to tell you the truth i thought i was gonna go out there use the fiskers i was actually gonna try to put the uh big league lawn striper kit on there but it's an axle so i'd have to go back and buy a clamp so it's like free rotating and it's like why not just put a bunch of wheels back there i've seen it done before i think striper man you have this uh i just don't see a tutorial for it so that's what we did it $40 with some pliers, six wheels, and we're gonna have a giant back roller on the Fiskars manual reel motor. I'm doing some laundry, sorry if you can hear that. All right, so this plate here, right, goes right here, there's a little spring, and it attaches like this, and I took that all the bolts right here these guys are hex 8 mils yep hex 8 mil easy peasy and then you have the axle washers for the stock wheel and then this cover here is put on with these 10 millimeter bolts so I'm not too far ahead of you guys next thing we're gonna do is there's a little thing here holding so the wheel doesn't go through. Close up on that. <clears throat> Perfect. Oh my gosh, it's perfect. It's literally perfect. Here's the stock wheel. These guys, gotta put them in the wheel. Like so. That sucker is striping. Yep, that sucker is striping like no one's business. <laughs>
night stripes. Oh man, I gotta do this tomorrow. <laughs> I was so bored today. Let me turn this down. Oh my gosh, I was so bored today. That was the project. I had to go back to the store three times. <laughs> oh, the, the outer wheels weren't catching, so it wasn't spinning the reel. So I had to find something like, uh, like snow chains because I, I couldn't find a wheel that was the perfect circumference to match the outer stock wheels. <sighs> but it came out okay. It's nighttime. We're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna come back in the morning and see how the stripes turned out. And then we're gonna go down to an inch. That was two inches. That's crazy. I mean, it showed up. The stripe showed up. <laughs> this is hilarious, dude. Okay, let me show you what I did. So at first, we were just gonna put this guy on, right? But I didn't wanna get another um, adapter thing. So we, I just, I was like, you know what? I've, I've, seen, I've seen the big thing. There she is. Isn't that funny? I mean, there's my snow chains. <laughs> so now it actually spins. Oh, this is the funniest thing on earth. This is why we do this stuff, because it's hilarious. I mean, when you're when you're rolling, it's bumpy. But on the grass, you can't tell. At least the real spin. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh, that is funny. Yeah, take a, take a gander one more time. <laughs> it looks like the Batman mobile. It looks like the Batmobile. The Christian Bale one. Oh, that is so funny. But them stripes, man, I'm telling you, they, get, they laid down. They laid down for sure. That was a hefty project, I'm not gonna lie. But it was fun. Um, we're gonna test it out tomorrow. We're gonna go level, or uh, one inch. I got another project. You guys are gonna laugh at this one too. So the roller on the back of the Sunjo, they're just too small. We're gonna have to do something about that. So I picked these guys up. These are riding lawnmower deck rollers. Let's see if they fit on the back. Yeah. Is that a 13er? Is that a 13er? Oh my fingers! Just kidding. Let's see, we got this loose. Oh man. Oh man. Oh my gosh. That's all it is. It's just this and this. What? Look at that, just a rod with two little hollow. We should have been putting sand in these guys. What the fudge? I mean. <laughs> Here's a one. Yeah, that's one. There's a two, a three, and a four. Come on! Oh my, does that fit? 
No way. Four of them fit. If we put nuts and bolts in there, it'll give it some weight? Or is that enough? Huh. Oh, deck roller action. <laughs> oh yeah, let's take off the stickers. You know what, we got nine of these guys. The stickers will wear off over time. <laughs> the stickers will wear off. Let's see if we can make these guys a little bit heavier though. Put some nails in here. Who keeps calling me? Yeah, I was just, uh, I was just at the Home Depot. No, I'm putting nails in these rollers so they're heavier. All right, fight back. Okay, I can like that. We're all even. Let's go. So they stick to one, they stick even, you know what I mean? I don't have any washers. Yeah, I'm gonna get some washers to stick right there. That way it's even. That'll be a solid. Cool. Cool. stuff last night and it started raining so I can't even use that but we're gonna go and pick something up today they finally got back to me after a couple days I've been uh, I've been eyeing this thing for a while now and uh, no one's picked it up so it's 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 mine it's mine I don't have a truck so I have to go rent a U-Haul and then we're gonna be on our way. So this is, uh, I haven't had a fantastic voyage in a while, so you guys are gonna follow me along the journey. We brought our, uh, our little deck rollers as well, so we can get some washers. But it's gonna be fun today. I'm not gonna let the rain bring me down, okay? Screw you, rain. Let's do this. You know what we gotta do first. If you've been if you've been subscribing, you know that we can't function unless we get one a thing. Come on! <laughs> All right, let's go, my dudes. Do you guys ever wonder, like, man, how does what is why does Yardbar have so much freaking time on his hands? You'll never know. <laughs> the directions took us to freaking almost Graham. And here he is right across the street from South Hill Mall in Puyallup. Bruh, that's like 10 miles difference. Thanks a lot. 
Thanks. <laughs> That's not a sign from the universe. You're still picking this thing up. Let's go. $20. That's more than $20. All right. Let's load her up. We got gas guzzling Sally. Looks like I'm hauling dogs from the dog pound. Oh, sorry, my mask. <laughs> Uh, post up. Maybe they'll let me film. Let's see. I'm gonna show you off. I've been. I used to use some um, that ironite. I love ironite. So have you ever used the the the, uh, the uh, natural kind of melagranite? Melorganite. Melorganite. That's my favorite. It's oh. on my channel every every time. Okay. <laughs> so, so is it pretty good? Is it really good or amazing? Amazing. It's an organic. It's it's nitrogen based. Right. You can you can put it down if it's wet, if it's hot, and the soil will absorb it when it needs it. Uh huh. Amazing. Put it down like four times a year. Okay. What is it like, thirteen bucks? Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because you know, I used um last year. Last year, I used ironite on this. Did it green it up a lot? It took about four weeks. Got it. Took two weeks. You could see it change it. You know, I really couldn't see it change it because I look at it every day. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. You know, my neighbor said, "Oh, yeah, your grass is getting really green." And, yeah, you know, yeah. One of my famous videos is all malorganite. So that's day one of malorganite. Day seven. There you go, yeah. <laughs> I mean, you know. Awesome. Let me video this real quick because this is going to be. This is too good. Awesome. But um, when you go this way, um, it's not this. I think it's like the. You'll see the guy on the right hand side. Okay. Check his lawn out. The guy on the right? The guy on the right. Okay. I cool. mean, you won't miss it. You'll, look, you, you'll, you'll, you'll just drive by and you go, whoa, that's nice. Yeah, nice. Okay, cool. Yeah. Sweet. Well, thank you so much. Sure. I really appreciate you. Yeah. Nice uh -huh. to meet you. And good luck with your work. Yeah. yeah. Like I said, check out that guy's yard. It's, um, I'm going to do that right He's now. got the California trimmers. He okay. used to he used to buy buy these things and fix them up and then resell. Them. Oh. So he's got he's got two California trimmers that I know of. Nice. He might have more. I don't know, but no. um, you, I mean, you won't miss his lawn. It's okay. Cool. It's, Can't wait. it's nice. Prime, huh? Yeah. Okay. It's cool. really nice. Yeah. Check it out, Yard Bruh. Check it I'm out. It, the next episode will be you. <laughs> yeah, be me. Okay. <laughs> thank you so much. Take care. Sure. Have a good one. Yeah. Thank you. Always cool. Cool people. Lawn people are always cool. Let's go check out that lawn he was talking about. Let's see how epic. He's nestled in. We can't miss it on the right. I mean, that one was okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. This guy's tripping. Yeah, he's right. That lot is ridiculous. You can't miss it because it's gorgeous. Oh my gosh. That's golf course style for sure. Ooh boy. You were right, my friend. Oh wow. Oh wow. Nice. Well, my friend, you were right. That that lawn looks pretty ridiculous. <laughs> All right, my dudes, let's go and uh, return this epicness. Can't wait. Funky little shack. Funky little shack.
here. We provide that motor. Yes, that is aftermarket. This is a little loose. It's a little loose. We have to get a belt. You are in luck! That's all I needed. And it, it became personal with me.
like I haven't used a kit lens in, since the beginning of time. That's so funny. It's been an awesome weekend. All these projects and real mowers. Let's finish up this on Joe. Yep, you focus on him, buddy. You loud little frickin' lens. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna change the lens. Uno momento. You know, you can't beat that L glass. It's just too sharp. Yazerskis. All right, so, does this thing fit through? Good thing I bought bigger than the required. Boom. A boom. OE deck roller. So it's going to affect the height of cut just a little bit, but not too much. Love it. We'll catch you in the next video. Take it easy.